A reading from the beginning of the letter of St. Paul to the Ephesians. Paul, an apostle of Christ Jesus by the will of God, to the holy ones who are in Ephesus, and faithful in Christ Jesus, grace to you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us in Christ with every spiritual blessing in the heavens, as he chose us in him before the foundation of the world to be holy and without blemish before him. In love he destined us for adoption to himself through Jesus Christ, in accord with the favor of his will, for the praise of the glory of his grace that he granted us in the Beloved. In Christ we have redemption by his blood, the forgiveness of transgressions, in accordance with the riches of his grace that he lavished upon us. In all wisdom and insight he has made known to us the mystery of his will in accord with his favor, that he set forth in him as a plan for the fullness of times to sum up all things in Christ, in heaven and on earth. The word of the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. The Lord has made known his salvation. The Lord has made known his salvation. Sing to the Lord a new song, for he has done wondrous deeds. His right hand has won victory for him, his holy arm. The, the Lord, Lord has made known his salvation. The Lord has made his salvation known in the sight of the nations. He has revealed his justice. He has remembered his kindness and his faithfulness toward the house of Israel. The Lord has made known his salvation. All the ends of the earth have seen the salvation by our God. Sing joyfully to the Lord, all you lands. Break into song. Sing praise. The Lord has made known his salvation. Sing praise to the Lord with the harp, with the harp and melodious song, with trumpets and the sound of the horn. Sing joyfully before the King, the Lord. The Lord has made known his salvation. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. I am the way, the truth, and the life, says the Lord. No one can come to the Father except <coughs> through me. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Glory, Glory to you, Lord. Lord. The Lord said, Woe to you who build the memorials of the prophets whom your fathers killed. Consequently, you bear witness and give consent to the deeds of your ancestors, for they kill them and you do the building. Therefore, the wisdom of God said, I will send to them prophets and apostles, some of them they will kill and persecute, in order that this generation might be charged with the blood of, the, of all the prophets shed since the foundation of the world, from the blood of Abel, to the blood of Zechariah, who died between the altar and the temple building. Yes, I tell you, this generation will be charged with their blood. Woe to you, scholars of the law! You have taken away the key of knowledge. You yourselves did not enter, and you stopped those trying to enter. When Jesus left, the scribes and Pharisees began to act with hostility towards him and to interrogate him about many things, for they were plotting to catch him at something he might say. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise, Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Christ. 